What's up, guys? I'm the Nerdy Ginger, and this is Spencer. Welcome back to Legend of the Minish Cap. What's so. up? We just finished up the second dungeon, the Cave of Flames. We're gonna be heading back to High Wolf to Castle Town. We're gonna be doing a bit of Kinstone fusion. And just about every, just most characters in the game, you can fuse Kinstones with. We can even fuse it with Malari. But we're gonna be able to. Ha we're gonna want to get our sword back first, of course. Wow, that was fast work, but not so fast that I didn't finish your sword. Here, take a look. I call this new blade the White Sword. Brilliant, <laughs> brilliant name. You got the White Sword. Its beautiful white blade sparkles with light. You can put away your grandfather's sword now. Sweet, so we got a better sword. Once you infuse it with the power of the elements, ooh, it will become a sacred blade. The forest elder no doubt told you this part, but it, <clears throat> if you want to infuse the sword, you must go to the elemental sanctuary. The sanctuary is a strange realm. Trapped between two worlds. It is the bridge between the Minish world and the human world. The doorway to the sanctuary opens only once every hundred years. You'll find that door hidden within Hyrule Castle. Once the blade has been filled with the power of the four elements, you should be able to break the curse on your princess. I know you can do it. After all, you made short work of that human mind. Let me tell you about a shortcut you can get you can use to get down from the mountain. You'll find it right in front of the entrance to the mine you just explored. Just follow that and you'll be down in no time. Good luck. Sweet. Can you fuse Kinstone sure, with me? I want to fuse. I want to fuse with you. <laughs> let's try, uh, let's try exiting. Let's have on his head. I don't know. Let's try exiting the screen and coming back. Maybe we'll be able to fuse with him now. Aww. I'm gone. Balls. <laughs> I want to fuse with people. I want to fuse. Let me fuse. Ah, screw you. Fine. Forget you. I'm going down the, I'm going down the hill now. Woo! Hey, don't you have to blow up that symbol, or did you already do that? We, we already did that. There used to be a there, remember? Oh yeah. Jump into the hole. All right, let's get let's get out of this place. Boom! 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 boom. Yeah. Uh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Lift the rocks. We. On a GTFO. On a GTFO. GTFO. Not Colonel Base. There, yeah. You're I think I, I think I might have not done the shortcut very well. Oh well, well we're almost at the bottom just anyway. Back the way you came up. <laughs> ah, screw it. We're almost done anyway. I probably should have picked up that rupee, but eh. <laughs> so where to next? All right, we're going we're going back to the Hyrule Castle Town. We do some fusing, and there's also another. There'll also be the dungeon called the Cave of Winds that we'll be able to, or the some. I don't know what it was called. I honestly don't remember what it was called. I believe Whatever this... the one with the wind element is. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Now remember this little hole that we came down here before. This is where we got one of our things. Oh wait. Ugh. We won't be able to come back to here until later. We'll actually need to go to the castle before we can do any of that. Da -da 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 I will castle. We. Are you sure you look alright? I never know what to wear to formal occasions. Okay. I, ne I had no idea this was a formal occasion, but whatever. Just head, just gonna be head to, heading down the stairs a bit, and roll out here. Yeah. Courtyard. There it is. Steven, look. See how that doorway glows? Could that be the door that leads to the sanctuary? Nobody in the castle seems to be able to see it but you and me. Let's go, quickly. Whee! Elemental Sanctuary. Oh, what a beautiful theme. Yeah. That you but can't hear. Crystals. Is this like a oh, dungeon too? No. Oh. This is what the point of the elements are. You'll see in a sec. Okay, well you can put two on there already. Yep. So this is the elemental sanctuary then. This is where we can infuse your blade with the power of the elements. Yes, there seems to be a pedestal for your sword right in the middle there. How convenient. <laughs> put our sword in here. Drop. Put that fire and earth in there. I combine the power of earth and fire. Lasers and our sword turns purple or red. Same thing. <laughs> Yay! Nice. Da 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 da. <laughs> the powers of the earth and fire elements have infused into your blade. Ooh. You what got here? some text to read. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see if I can't read that tablet for you. Fill your sword walk with power and walk over the glowing tile. Perhaps it refers to those flashing spots on the floor around you. What are oh, you waiting no. for? Try it, Steven. 
Okay. Uh, it's, you've gone too far. Jeez. Oh, Alright, so just hold out your sword. Charge up the spit attack. This bar will start charging up. Once that fills up, you can walk over these pe these little tiles. Oh, and you weird. can split into two people. Oh, nice. Well, you just split into two. So this is the power of the white sword. I guess you can double yourself like that anytime you see those panels. Sweet. Oh, that's sweet. That must be how we're going to get out of here. Alright, charge it up. It takes a long time to charge it up. Good thing I have the speed button. Well, it's a good... And now we can both step oh, on the uh... buttons. Yeah! If you run into the wall or anything with your clone, they'll disappear, just so you know. <laughs> they'll also disappear when the bar runs out. Alright, let's get out of here. Dun, dun, dun. Now we can go back to that hole in the ground. Yeah. Yeah. Hole in the ground. Let's get out of here. Woo! How you doing, guardsies? How you doing? Fuse. Just rolling. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if most guards can fuse. Uh oh. What's that? Interesting. Interesting. You're the last person I expected to find here. And just as I was wondering who could be behind this, I find my old master. Old master? Fati! I thought you were your grandfather's sword. <laughs> and as always, you're dressed in. The shabbiest of rags. <laughs> My curses are not to be mocked. The one I cast on you is most powerful. No matter what power you wield, you will never break it. What curse is he talking about? I you have no idea. You haven't changed in the slightest. I can never have created that cap. It only fueled your insane desires. Fool, a hat that grants me grants the wishes of its wearer, wearer is a spectacular creation. Thanks to you, I have gone from being a meek, minuscule nothing to... The greatest sorcerer alive! You cannot stop me now, and I have you to thank for it. Accept this small gesture of gratitude from me. He split with some too. No. Fati, wait! Shit. Oh god! A mini boss. Spin attack! Ah, oh, the spears make him hard to hit. Yeah, yeah, no, you can only There's one. Them. One down. Spin attack ready! Boom! Easy peasy. <laughs> Yay. That foul Vati. What could he be shimming now? Steven, I feel I owe you an explanation of what has happened. You see, Vati and I are both Minish. Dun dun dun. I was once a famous Here comes sage the story. and renowned the vi a, vi a renowned vi <laughs> Minish craftsman. Vati was only a boy when I took him in as my apprentice. But he became enchanted by the wickedness of the hearts of men. One day, Vati took a hat I made for the humans. My pride and joy. It granted the wishes of its wearer. He put it on without permission. Oh. There it is. Vati! What are you doing there? Oh, he's an old man. <laughs> oh, snap. Now he looks beastly. <laughs> I know. Oh, what a vile form he's taken. <laughs> vile. I am a sorcerer now, and my power is beyond compare. No longer will I tire away as your apprentice. Now I should now they shall call me master. Why, Vati, what are you plotting? This year, on the day that comes once a century, the portal opens. And when it does, I shall claim the light force as my own. I will be transformed. Perfect. And there will be none who can stop me. You don't know. No! No, Ezlo! God! <laughs> I'm a duck! That looks like a head. <laughs> Tell me, <laughs> how does it feel? My sorcerer's curse. Do you see me, Ezlo? I am truly your master now, and you cannot stop me. And with that, I must be leaving. <laughs> Ezlo! And then he goes on your head. <laughs> <laughs> you know the legends, of course. The gifts the Bakori gave the humans. What you call the Bakori Blade was the first of those gifts. The second, well, you call it Light Force, but a source of limitless magical power. If Vati were to get it now, it would be devastating. I came to the world of men hoping to stop Vati, and I met you in the woods. But it seems we won't be breaking the curse on me anytime soon. Aww. However, with the Sacred Blade, we can certainly restore Princess Zelda. 
I'm sorry. All that has happened has been due to my own pride. My folly. I must rely on you, on your power, until we get to put an end to Vati. Well, on the bright side, you look really good on my head. <laughs> well, Steven, enough fairy tales. We must search for the next element. Yeah, element. All right, search for the next First element. First, gotta go to the hole in the ground. <laughs> First, we're gonna end have some fun in Hyrule Town. Well, that's all the time we got, guys. I'm the Rage Ender. This is Spencer. Join us so, next time. Let's the Minish Cap. See you guys next time. Bye bye. What are you doing, postman? Get out of my face.